Good evening, everybody, and welcome to week two of the Final Fantasy Spring 2020 tournament. We've got Earth Flags this week, and we've got a Wappy in the booth. How are you doing today? I'm doing all right. How are you doing? Kind of excited here. Yeah, not too bad. I, I got a cookie, I got an orange. We're good to go. All right. Well, I guess I'll uh, let them let them go. Yeah, let's let them go. get started. So yeah, um, normally I like to ask, you know, what you think about the the party composition, but we're going full Artea today. Yeah, I do not like Artea comps, but here we go. Yeah, it's going to be very interesting. I think Temple of Fiends is going to prove to be quite swingy with this, um, and it's going to be very pivotal for some good magic to land in the top three for uh, the fighter. Yeah, yeah. Or, uh, you know, just shooting for level 35 on that NASA. Here we go. And we got a hand axe. Woo! Just kidding. Um, We're gonna buy the saber. See, we've got invis and heal 3, and then light lit 3 and level 1 temper. Always nice to see. Yeah, that temper is gonna be useful. And pro rings are ludicrously expensive, and uh, a wood hat for, for Shadow Walker. Ludicrous, or are they plaid? Ah, oh, they've gone plaid. Cabins actually for a decent price. Uh, when they're cheap like that, I like to try to pick up two or three just so I can do Temple of Fiends in, in a couple stages. Uh, makes it a little bit safer, and also I don't feel so bad if Garland has something really, really awful. Yeah, I agree. I Looks like Shadow disagrees, but... I agree with your assessment. Now we got zombies with stun touch, which is lovely when you're running a two-man party. Oh, maybe he just forgot, because there he went out and saved. It looks like Grendy's gonna go ahead and get like a couple of levels before he makes the makes the journey. Yeah, it might not be a bad idea to get a couple more spell charges on the uh, on the black mage because. Um, Ooh, a black point. shirt. That is super nice. Anytime you can get a spellcasting item in a, in a two-person comp like this, it's so, so valuable. Yeah, that's going to speed us up a lot. Yeah, I'd say that's almost advantage Shadow since he's not doing this quick grind. Don't need spell charges when you got a casting item. Pays off a little bit. Just that is some good experience. Can Shadow make it to the make it to the exit here? Yep. We're good. Oh, oh. maybe not so much. That is that is a rude dude. <laughs> yes, it is. But he made it through. Well. We'll see if he can get to the princess. There he goes. Yeah, not a bad character for all of the, uh... <laughs> all the experience to land on. We have a canoe and a loot. This feels like a 1 for one seat. And we've got Grendy now entering the Temple of Fiends. Down to the Black Mage. Interesting. I always like having the spellcaster items on the melee character. Yeah, especially this early and with this party. Like you're gonna need a bit more uh, firepower early for that fighter, since you've only got the two characters. Yeah, it's also a little difficult to uh, pick up swords, especially uh, we haven't seen a, a large money chest yet. Alright, so Gren just smacks Garland, and, and that seemed to work out okay. So, no Quad X sighting, and, and there's a bunch of wolves. And we got Fire 3 at our level 2 black magic. I didn't see the white magic. Uh, we got Ice 2, and yeah, I missed the white magic, but I wouldn't be surprised if Gren checks it. Thank you. 
But yeah, one other thing uh, about Shadow Walker's playstyle is that he's very aggressive at killing everything in the early game, and is pretty good about knowing what enemies to kill. So, kind of the the goal of of running a two man is to get out of that sort of danger zone where you get paralyzed and stone touched and poison touched all the time. Uh, and the only way to do that is to get your magic defense up. And the sooner everybody gets into like the 20s, the better off they are. And Shadow's got uh, kind of a nice advantage that just aggressively beating up everything gives you levels very quick. Yeah, I'd say aggressive is maybe the best way to describe his playstyle. And we have a 32k adamant. Yeah, and now that sort of leaves the question. Um, you've got the canoe. You've got some options as far as where you can dive to pick up the money for that. You want to do pop grind? You want to go into volcano? Should we just check out some of the extra chests that you can get to, like the Toyas and, and Dwarf Cave? Or maybe you just want to go into, into Marsh. You never know. Um, friends don't let friends dive Marsh. Oh, what could possibly go wrong? Well, you're level six, so everything. Yeah, it'll be fine. Not much going on up at the Toyas. The iron armor's not too bad to find, the opal shield's not too bad to find, and especially because there are a lot of good shields kicking around the game. Uh, if opal shield sells for a good chunk of money, that's kind of kind of nice to have right now. Yeah, I think the iron armor is also for sale over in uh, Provoca, so... Yeah, it's just, it just saves you some money. You, you picked it up anyway. So, back to Canaria. More supplies. We're gonna be- we're gonna be river rafting, I think, so... I mean, goes. you gotta get your quarantine snacks. It is true, you don't see a lot of people out on the overworld right now. Yeah, I, I assume they've just been hit with corona just like the real world. You're just gonna, you're just gonna go up to Astos and he's just gonna be keeled over already, like, oh, uh, well, alright then, I'll, I'll just take this. Nah, he's, he's on a ventilator, he's fine. It's <laughs> <laughs> just Astos in an iron lung. Ooh, a ribbon! <laughs> One of the other extremely important items to get in two man, so... Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's make sure that that sweeper doesn't die. Yeah, this this seed so far is kind of free, minus the thirty two k out of it. That's that's not free. Ooh, and a ruby. Well, okay, that gives you something different to do. Where's the canal? You know, it's in marsh. Canal's always in marsh. Yeah, it'll it'll be great. They're gonna have full clear volcano and ice, and then nothing will be in there. And you go back to yeah, mine. that's. You've heard it here. That's what's gonna happen. Alright, so Grundy finishing off the uh, the magic purchasing here. Fire 3, Ice 2, not bad. So, Black Shirt and Ice 2, pretty good if you wanna do some shenanigans in Volcano. Uh, Fire 3, pretty essential if you wanna do anything in Ice Cave. Oh yeah, definitely. And I still didn't see what was level two white magic. Nope. Oh, well, we might get to see what's uh, hanging out here in old Elfland. Shadowwalker has enough levels for level three magic, so not a bad choice to, to pick this up before heading over to Crescent Lake area.
But yeah, we're nine minutes into the game and he's already level eight, so pretty good clip so far, especially on the enemies that he could find in here. And you know, Nuke is pretty good against everything, I've heard. That's all right. Can, like, should I buy Lock 2 or not? Uh, this, maybe you'll use it. Yes, Fizzle, if your levels can match the timer, that's a good run. What, what do you do at 51, though? 51 minutes? I, you're gonna stop. It's not gonna work. It should be done by now. Oh, Black yeah. Magic level 4 is, is awful, but um, you can pick up Lock there, which is good, because it will no longer be on the same level as Nuke. We've got... Yeah, that was life. Yeah, that was Night Learnable Life. That's that's what you're looking for. So, yeah, put the ribbon on the knight. Teach him life. We've got a plan for, for the second half of the game. Just, yeah. just getting there. Free seed is free, and I guess friends do let friends dive marsh? Well, we've we've also got another plan, and it's um, it's um this one's a doozy. So let's, uh, let's go for the gamble right here. I mean, we got good spells. We got decent levels. I... It'll, it'll be okay, right? Yeah, it, it, that's not for us to decide. That's for the enemies to decide. Or the I'm, ho I'm hoping for Thunder. Thunder's not in this race. It's Shadow and Grendy. <laughs> Fair enough. But this might not be a bad idea. Shadow Walker can knock the... If, if Shadow Walker finds some good money here, he can knock the, uh, the Adam and out. But getting stunned, not part of the equation here. And neither is fighting a large enough. Dude, I mean, how do you... What, what, is, what is a sword but a large knife? I guess that's true, but why can a thief use a large knife but not a short sword? I... We will never know. Mysteries, mysteries. Oh, speaking of mysteries, how did that black mage stand up to stop? Holy cow. It's, it's okay, nothing was worthwhile up there anyway. But there was a large knife. We lost our, our sword. Oh, maybe, maybe he'll go back and get it through the link chest. Nope. Maybe? Oh, bat blocked. Ah, well, it's, well that, was, that was one of the things I was talking about. Let's see. I think the ghouls had stopped. Yep, okay. <laughs> that black mage is doing work. It's like just the just the concept of the of the black shirt is letting him resist time magic. Ooh, those are beefy scorpions with squint. Yeah, that's that's not so good. Um Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 real bad. Yeah, that's that'll leave also, a mark. That's also real bad. So yeah, Shadow is we'll call this an information dive at this point. Because there's there's not a lot of stuff that's coming back up if, if this is what Shadow has to deal with. Oh, ye of little faith. That black mage has nuke. He's got this. <laughs> he has nuke, but does he have turn order? Tor turn order, spurn order. Well, he's also got a bunch of heal potions, too. Oh, no. Oh, hey, scorpions. Here they are. Rocky like a squinty cane? No? Didn't land. Didn't land. That new planted though. This is gonna be such a lopsided party if this continues. Like if the black mage makes it out, he's gonna have like three levels. We got sandworms and you're dead. I mean, it might be the most shadow party ever though. Alright, and well, is it a gamble if both players do it? I mean... I... No. Yes? I don't know. 
You're asking some really deep questions here, man. I don't know. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> So yeah, question in chat: Was there a gentleman's agreement? Yeah, they did. Uh, they did a little party draft, and they decided, you know what? Let's let's try this. What could go wrong? Answer everything. All right. So Shadow Walker at level nine, knowing the con knowing the contents of half the chests in Marsh, and. Well, the zombies roll low enough, the ghouls not so much, but they're also not casting stop very often. Let's see, we have frag level six. Yeah, like a lit two at level six as well. And a slab. Yeah. Old man's like, I can't learn this language, you take it. Can you install Rosetta Stone on my computer for me? Oh god, they have Fire 2 followed by Stop. What a... That's, that's not so good. That's pretty okay for Shadow, though. Yeah, that's... Was that off Hard Reset? Um, I don't know. Um, they seem to have a decent amount of health, but nothing that can't be dealt with with the resources at hand. So yeah, if that's off if that's off hard reset, um, we may have like level fifteen Shadow Walker pretty soon. Yeah, that's that's gonna make the rest of this game a lot easier. <laughs> One peed. Uh, Grendy trying to get that large knife. I don't know if he knows that there's a large knife there, but he's gonna be real excited. He's gotta have that sword. That's something for the Black Mage to hold. And then not use. <laughs> hold is the right word. I don't know. Anytime I find the wizard staff, I hang onto it just to equip it. Um, Gregly, because the sandworms were me and behind Squint. Um, scorpions. Yeah, it's not the sandworms that you're worried about, it's everything else. Yeah. Also, three floors down? Whoops, I don't need are important, that's fine. We've already discussed it's not that good of a spell. It's only good when you have 36 charges of it, right? Yeah, yeah. Wait, how are you getting 36? Four, four red mages. Oh! <laughs> uh. Yeah, we had we had someone in uh, in our first first round uh, reroll their party so that they had four red pages and it was incredible. They but just they win. Yes, they just blasted their way. I think they had the fastest time too. They just went in blasting. It's like on average this will work, right? Just here, here, nine hundred damage a turn. Yeah, the only the only concern there is having enough charges to get through Topher. Oh, they, they all had life too as well. It was it was great. What level do you think Shadow stops at? I don't know. I figured fifteen, maybe sixteen would be pretty good. Um, it all depends on. Have you seen Warper Exit? But, I mean, you can pretty much cast all that stuff now. Is there, yeah. is there anything good? Is there anything good in Crescent Lake? I mean, Quad X, pretty solid. Yeah, get that Brack. Well, he's now level 15. Looks like that might be the spot. We still don't have enough money for that out of it. Nope. Wow, those are cheap as free tents. 
surprised he's not buying some. Okay, he's going back for those heal pots. Yeah, Grendy is committing real hard to, to Marsh, so maybe we'll see what's uh, what's going on at the bottom here. Yeah, Grendy is doing a good job of preserving spell charges too, like just knowing that the undead in here is frequently weak enough to just die to a spell that they they resist. It's pretty good heads up. And Kareem's with Glance. This is this sure is a seed. Yeah, so far so good. Thanks, Fizzle. We, we gave you a ribbon, what more do you want? Yeah, thanks, thanks, Fizzle, for doing the restream, and thanks to Danny for tracking. That's right. That's what. That's exactly what I meant. Oh yeah, and I, I don't think Shadow is is worried at all about preserving spell charges. Just. Or uh, saving spell charges for post promotion, just <laughs> you're gonna end up at like level thirty five or something. You'll you'll get whatever you need. Those those life charges will be there. Hardboils care not for your ice spell. No, they do not. I that is not an encounter I like seeing. Uh, just, unrunnable. Speaking of jerks, there's a there's a paralyzed uh, yeah, there is a paralyzed fighter. How about Ooh. how about that? Is that a that a fight you like seeing? That is a fight I like seeing on a trap tile. That is beautiful. Shadow picked the wrong grind. Well, maybe not. That is a beefy shark. Shark doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, thanks. That's that's in my head now. I, I appreciate it. Oh, that could help. Clearly, you're you're picking up on that sarcasm. <laughs> Sarcasm detector. Now oh, that's a useful invention. Alright, so Grendy finds the sandwiches and is just gonna nope out. And yeah, maybe we'll see what's in this chest. Oh, it's a cabin. I, I saw the capital letters in the in the C and got faked out. And we're down to one chest to see if this is worth the dive. Nope, not that one. Oh, one more. So Shadow Walker is doing the uh, the Torta Volcano here. Yeah, I thought he was a never squiggle left guy, but he did it. So, yeah. who am I? Ah, oh, man. That's so much experience. Oh, they poison touch too. I, I suppose that could be worse. But, yeah, that is uh, that is a lot to leave on the table, but it, that is really good to keep in the back of your mind when you have one of those shiny endgame swords and you just one-shot the shark. All right, so Grendy has um, adamant money and um, well, not much else. Lots of cabins. If he can get it out. All right, let's see. Meanwhile, Shadow Walker's running amok. I see what you did there. Uh, we also don't know what is on the uh, the worm pile. Oh, 
Oh, there's the game changer across from the canal. And, a and ribbon. another ribbon? Wow. Yeah, wow. Okay, so the volcano is the place to be. Yeah, there is always money in the banana stand. I mean, volcano. <laughs> there was 300,000 gold in the walls of the volcano. Pro Cape's pretty nice, too. Um, the mage armor has not been forthcoming so far, and uh, that is uh, that's a pretty good thing to have in the old shield slot. So, I'm always confused about it being a shield since it's called a Pro Cape. I'm always imagining that they're, like, actually wearing a cape, and he's just pretending to be a superhero. No, I mean, he is wearing the cape, but it's like a bullfighter cape. Oh, uh, okay. Like, like, just Olay, and, you know, the... the <laughs> Sorry, Olay and the Saber Team of Tiger just goes running away. I was just gonna say, the bull goes running by, but they're on two legs this game. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, man, he has no houses. Does he have adamant money yet? Doesn't matter. Going back in. Shadow's got nukes. Shadow does not have a halfway decent weapon, though. So this is a little dicey. Yeah, I'm a little surprised. I mean, maybe he's banking on finding a sword here. I mean, five nukes is a lot of nukes, but... He's got two ribbons in pretty good levels, but all it takes is a back row punch, and you are in uh, not-so-fun land. Yeah, especially on a Black Mage with only a pro as their armor. A oh, Light Axe will do, though. It's not great, but... Yeah, that's one of those that I don't feel pretty comfortable with that as a low level, but I think Shadow Walker is high enough where he's got an extra hit with it. And that makes a real big difference once you throw a temper on it. I see snacks. And an opal armor. It's pretty good fun. Um, that Argyne is huge. They almost always... Ooh, that's not good. That was two straight crits, too. That's disgusting. So I guess we're just getting information now. Yeah, not a not a bad play at this point. Just open the chests and then and then get out. Did Grandy get his money out? Uh, I think Grandy did get the money out, but it's uh, 22k I think on hand, and yeah, there's a power step. Oh boy, these guys are everywhere. Trying to play that black mage like an accordion. Spines do not work that way. Dude, anything works that way if you believe hard enough. Oh, speaking of if you believe hard enough, this shadow might just be taking a shot at this instead of instead of resetting out. And you never know, right? Enough nukes, all things are possible. Oh, there's a miss. That, that one wasn't gonna miss. All okay. Right. Not all things. I, I'm all a liar. Right. So Shadow leaving two chests in the bottom. Not a whole lot desirable, so... Who wants to do Ice Cave? Ooh, ooh, I do. Who wants to do Ice Cave the long way? I, I lied, I don't. Yeah, me either. Uh, who wants to do pop grant? I think he's just gonna go by the adamant. That pop, I've never seen Shadow do a pop grant. Yeah, I wasn't sure if, if Shadow found enough loose cash kicking around, but uh, maybe there's enough to sell. Well, he fought a bazillion 
pieds and uh, picked up picked up some some things in armory. I figure he's probably got the cash. Yeah, weirdly enough, though, the peds are just not so hot on money. But yeah, it looks like he's going to have barely enough. Because, yeah, after all those billions of peds, he only had 10k on hand. And Grendy finds silver swords, which aren't bad. Uh, a sell opal armor, maybe? Maybe? Oh, this feels bad. This does feel bad. It's about a thousand short. Sell so that purple. Come on. No. How much left? Thirty. Oh Jesus. I'll give you. I'll give you thirty-five. Is he gonna sell them for me? Come on, is. dude. <laughs> How much will you give me for the short sword? Oh, gone. <laughs> Goodbye, purple. Oh boy, now if you don't find anything else, this feels real awful. My suggestion to Shadow Walker does not save while dropping this off, just just in case it's a Thor hammer. That's not a bad idea. Nope, he's saving. Uh, he is saving and is gonna go the long way. All right. You ready for this bridge, boss? Uh, we got some big brain plays here. Hey, it's the credits. Who developed this? Entroper. Who contributed? Artea. All right. We learned something today. Dun, 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 dun. That was the more you know case. Oh, are we X-Files thing? <laughs> the truth is out there. I I guess Brat is calling Artea a goat. Seems a little mean. We have to take this tail! <laughs> Mournful for tail! Alright! Uh, that's funny. <laughs> Grandy is in the right spot now. Yep. Shadow Walker is doing the uh, the tour to the inner island here. You have to take at least one lap before you can beat the game, so I'm glad we're getting this out of the way. The, the victory lap? Yeah. I suppose, but this is a little longer than the running around the chaos foot. Oh god! These jerks have trance, too? Get this out of here. Yeah, um, I'm kind of in your boat one fine day. I, I think I also probably would have hit ice while I was there, except that he didn't have any houses, so he was out of spell charges. Yeah, it seemed like a, a calculated risk, and it was just like, you know what, I'm going to turn in this ruby and see what I get. Randy was just given the business a bit by those uh, Gersharks and uh, big guys. Yeah, there's a lot of incentives laying around, so... And we didn't even see what was uh, for sale in, in Melman as far as uh, spells go. Never know where warp ships. Yeah, I imagine he's hoping he's gonna find the floater and then he can just promote and then come back and buy his spells. Hey, there's an Oxiel, but this is Earth Week, so sorry. I mean, there's still a lot of chests. Could be loose down there. That's true, we got, we got two loose. And Grundy has a canal. So yeah, all things considered, Grundy not too far behind. Shadow Walker does have a lot of information, and definitely some levels, but... It's not insurmountable. No, we're definitely keeping a fairly close race here. He's probably five or ten minutes away. Ten at the most. Depends on how his uh, dives here go. Ooh, a Cheerio. Opal bracelet. Alright. You have mage armor.
So, is he gonna go do Earth now, I assume? Because that's incentive, right? That, that's the whole point of Earth Week. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's incentivized, but we also have, um, we have Ordeals, and we have Waterfall. So, a couple of other options here. And, um, we don't have a rod. Yeah, I'm not a fan of uh, doing Earth without rod, but this is what we're going to see this week, right? We're going to get some Trap Child checks, which is interesting because we've already found two really good two-man grinds. Shark and his friend Shark. Do, 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 do. No. Bring it back. Do, do, do. Yeah, I brought it back. Oh, yeah. And Grandy's making his exit from Volcano now that he's got his canal and also isn't gonna do ice. Alright, so we have Silver Armor, which is, um, absorb-wise, worse than Iron Armor. But Evasion-wise, much better. Kareeb's laugh in the face of Fire 3. Sure are a lot of snakes in here. Didn't know we were doing an Indiana Jones Earth Week. Why does it have to be snakes? Alright, so Grundy hanging out in Crescent Lake. Just topping off the old inventory. Oh, we have a power cycle. We gotta find some beads? Nope. Yeah, Grundy's levels aren't bad. He's not far behind in levels, so... I don't think he really needs to peak grind at this point. Yeah, and, um, yeah, not much of anything in, in Earth, it seems. I mean, you don't want that 700 gold? No, I mean, the, the wood staff's probably the big ticket item, right? Especially since you, you left the large knife behind. You bring up a good point. Now, now his, his black mage has something to use, or can they use wooden staffs? Oh, absolutely. I don't even know. It's the iron staff that they can't use. It's yeah, too, that's it. That's too, it. Heavy. too heavy. I love these seven pack garbage unrunnables. This is this is not a difficult dungeon. It's just incredibly annoying. Except when arachnids have thunder. Thunder arachnids are not fun. <laughs> thunder, eight thunder arachnids don't care you have ribbons. You're still gonna die. So especially when they ambush you. Oh yeah. Oh, we have a oh that's a Zeus. Alright. Grundy picking up the element. See if he's got to sell his note. Okay, he's got money. Yeah, big old pile of cash. Yeah, enough for some more houses and heal potions. And and a bat. 
NPC guillotine can't get here soon enough. Alright, so this will be fun. You get to walk this out. Yes, fun. That's that's the right word. Well, I mean, the, the fun part is, is punching the vampire, right? Yeah. By punching, you mean fire three, right? Well, I mean, you can always do black bolt strats, too. Uh, yeah, we can get a, a recap. Um, so, King had canoe, Sarah had loot. Uh, we killed some uh, mono recap. I'm, I'm not sure what that even means. I'm out of the meme loop. Uh, Vicky had the TNT. There was a vendor item for 32,000 in Provoca. Um, Narek had the Ruby. Um, we had a loose canal and volcano, which and uh, the blacksmith gave us tail. Titan's got an oxyale, and uh, Sarda gave us some Cheerios. Um, we had a uh, peed grind off a hard reset, which uh, gave uh, Shadow the levels he needed, and Grandy's kind of gotten his levels as he's gone. Up. As far as big ticket items go, we have found two ribbons, which is really all you need now. And we found the Vorpal, which Shadow sold and Grundy held on to. Now we got Ice 3, Fire 2, that, Slep. That ain't work. Slep and Slep 2, though, man. Ah, uh, the big sleep. Alright, Grundy, what is in the old armor shop here? Oh, an opal shield that is, sells for bupkis. And Grundy's gonna go get his opal, I assume. Ah, oh, these wizards seem to have rolled a little on the high side. Wizards? Not so fun. Well, I feel like wizards always roll on the high side. I hate them. They're, they're real big jerks. All this, oh, I can cast magic. No, I'm just gonna punch you three times instead. It's almost like they're mind flayers. Oh, there's a cube. That was not necessary. Maybe it is. Maybe we've got loose floater in Sky 4. I'm calling it now. Loose rod in Sky 4, also a big problem. All right, we've got two loose up in sky. It, that's 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 what the comps team is called for. And more bats. Sky four is the base floor. You're right. Sky three. <laughs> I mean, I mean that no one would suspect to look for it there. No one said we were good at being comps. <laughs> I mean, I mean, what if Fizzlebeef put an orb there? Nobody would ever find it. <laughs> we're the comms teams you, you deserve, not the comms team you asked for. Fizzlebeef, you're just mad that I thought of it first. <laughs> Wait, they were Tia too? Oh no! I, I, I want to play Fizzle Seed. That sounds fun. Oh, you have no idea. Yeah, um... I, I'm sure Fizzle can hook you up. I mean, I've played like two seeds in the last eight months, so I'm sure not, what can go wrong? And for the record, 
because I, I mentioned a date, I looked at my wrist as though it was I was looking at a, at a watch that I don't know. Just just so everybody can realize I'm I'm smart. Four freckles past the hair. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Nah, it's uh four four cat scratches past the hair. That's... Oh, you have a grumpy cat too, huh? Yeah, yeah. I have one that's really nice, and one that I picked up earlier, because sometimes she likes being picked up, and I have lots of scratches. She, she, today was not a day to pick her up. Yeah, my, my cat will go from, from zero to 60 in a heartbeat. Like, I'll just be petting her, and all of a sudden I'll just get the E-Honda slap, and I'm like, what did I do? Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> Cats are great. Everybody should have one. Oh, yeah, yeah, wonderful. Looks like Shadow's gonna check out the waterfall and Grendy's gonna skip his queue. Now we're gonna top off on some, uh, some equipment first, though. Yeah, but, um, no warp in sight means, uh, yeah. Walk in, walk out. Enjoy. And I don't know where Grundy is headed. Is this, um, Ice Cave? Uh, no, I think he's trying to go north. That's one of the tricky things about these, uh, these sa sail everywhere seeds is... How do I get to where I want to go? Yeah, it definitely takes a bit of time and practice to figure out what's the fastest way around the planet. Or whatever we want to call this. I just I just wish the broom gave me a GPS that didn't take 30 minutes to load. But if we've got a... If, if it turns out we don't have loose items behind that queue, Grandy's really making up some time here. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be pretty convenient, for sure. Oh god, we have fast at level 7. Well, you know what? You're gonna have plenty of charges. Yeah, level 7 and not promotion locked, so... Alright. Yeah. And for some reason, nightmares with way more HP than they should. And we are just going for mermaids. Sure, why not? It's a lot of chests. I mean, you haven't seen two incentive items and you got a cherry already. You probably expect that you need at least one of them. And we're still looking for a sword. And... I don't know. I don't, I don't hate it. Fl a floater so I can hold an imitation sword. Yeah. I mean, personally, I don't, I don't hate the Vorpal, but I get it. I, I only hate it when it does like four hits, four damage. So all the time. A little bit. But we got, we got nine temper charges by the end of the seed, though. We should be good. What is with the Gersharks being on every trap tile? It's the, this is the third one we've seen. The game can't get the song out of its head either. <laughs> and they still have infinite health. I think the most frustrating thing about the Gershark fights is that they have just a ridiculous amount of M-Def, so... I, I can't just, I can't just break them. It just doesn't work. And the robot's given us a rod, so... Okay, well, that uh, Shadow Walker probably feels a little bad about that, but... Hey, hey it's, it's ex extra experience, right? Yeah. It's like, it's like how the journey is the reward. 
Don't stop believing. Not that journey. No, no, no. Oh, hey, the Earth Sharks again. And we're back here. Welcome to the Curse Shark Seed. This, these are the only enemies. Let's see. The guys, <laughs> guys, Sea Week was last week. We've secretly replaced all the encounters with Gersh Sharks. Well, let's see if they notice. <laughs> Oops, all Gersh Sharks. Did he not equip that flame sword? I believe he's also realizing he did not equip that flame sword. <laughs> Grandy, my dude, you got a silver sword. Oh, does Grandy not have the silver sword equipped? Grandy, yeah. There we go. All right. We got there. Those aren't Gersh sharks. What are they doing in this seat? <laughs> oh no, more Gersh sharks. Now that's more like it. I, I'm gonna be very concerned if, if Grundy runs out of resources on the way out, because that is a lot of experience. Yeah, I mean, at least you can run from this encounter, so maybe he can just get away from it on the way out. But I'm terrified of ghosts. Me too. In real life and in the game. I swear my house is haunted. I just feel like I was punched for 150 damage. <laughs> oh, Thunderfrost Giants. Uh, question in chat. Do tournament runs usually have identical party builds? Um, it is up to the runners whether they want to draft a party or not um, in the Swiss rounds. So um, they just decided, gentlemen's agreement, let's, let's do something ridiculous. And, and boy howdy are we in the thick of it. Shadow use a house? Oh, okay, he's gonna go. I like it. And and Shadow Walker, meanwhile, is staying at the the, the JW Marriott on rack. Hey, we are we're gonna see what's in these mermaid chests. Oh, there's a ice this is a nice shield. Like Shadow's gonna do left side first. There's a silver bracelet. Yeah, kinda useful, I guess. A sun sword? That, that's a big improvement. Yeah, it's, uh, it's the best one we've seen to date. So. Dude, there's a vorpal. You're gonna offend some people out there. They love their trash cans. Oh, well, Ooh, Excal. Got Excal. So, I like the Excal vorpal combo. Um, just because you can trade the vorpal out, uh, or trade the vorpal in for Tia 2 and Chaos, who are the most likely to have really high defense values. Yeah, and with temper and fast, we can we can make a four-hole work. Yeah. I mean, Power Gauntlet is incentivized as well, so they will probably stumble upon it this seed. Just a matter of, um, where is the defense sword? Because that is, um, that is the absolute, you know, one-man tank uh, item set. We also have to find a floater to use some of these swords, so... We're... You know, hypothetical land at the moment. And Shadow's already level 23. But yeah, Excal is so good against regular mobs, too, that it's it's really a, it's really a nice find. 
just for everything that is not a, a Topher Fiend uh, named Chaos or, or Tiamat, it's so good. Oh, there's the defense. How about free floor? Flutter. Um, okay. So this is the seed that keeps on getting. I'd be tempted to walk that out at that point. I mean, that's that's the best sword that Shadow Walker has found, and you know what? He can make it work, because that thing gets uh, five hits at level 29. But he can't swing it yet, and it looks like he's going to go try and take Kraken with the... Uh, what's he swinging at the moment? A flame sword? The flame sword? He's got defense, sir. He's fine. Just hold it. There's a nice sword. Now, now I'd feel a lot better if I was him. So slightly better. Those aren't gross sharks. What what nonsense? Ooh. How come we don't have any war sharks? You want some like poison sharks or what? I mean we have whiz ogres, but no war ogres. Deep thoughts with Edgeworth. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Alright, so on the on the one hand these ghosts have a lot of HP, on the other hand they're not punching you. But on the other hand they have invis too, and that is really annoying. Hey, bait sword. Alright, well there you go, there's your emergency uh kraken. Uh Three defenses and, and spam bane sword. Oh, those those gir yeah, those worms have stun touch. That's that's not so good. Hey, can I get another baby shark reference? Do 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 do. do. Thank you. The the theme of the uh, the World Series winning Washington Nationals was Baby Shark their theme. <laughs> yeah. Huh. I mean, I would. It's better than banging on a trash can like the Astros, but. <laughs> All right, so. We have sold the Vorpal, and we know the Excal is kind of stashed in Mermaids, which may or may not be some place that Shadow Walker ever goes back to, especially now with Floater Excess. So with one loose, I would be very inclined to knock out all of the incentive locations that I can find, just to make sure that I don't need to search any more chests. Yeah, I mean, with defense, though, defense will... it's good enough. If he gets all the incentives, he probably will find Power Gauntlet. Yeah, if he does find Power Gauntlet, though, he needs the other loose. Unless it's Thorhammer. I will see. Uh, neither runner has been to Ice or Ordeals, so... We, uh, even though this is Sea Week, um... We, we've been pretty Sea Heavy. Even, even though it's Earth Week. Alright, oh, Earth Week, right. Hey, look. Hey, I made, I made it 58 minutes without screwing that up. <laughs> New record. <laughs> Yay. It's like the new record for Mario Party. You did it. I don't, I don't get the reference. I've never played a Mario Party game. Oh. I... I was gonna say poor you, but it's more like more like lucky you. I've seen way too many friendships destroyed by Mario Party. And this Kraken's just like, here have some ink. And while well, meanwhile we're microwaving it. Yeah, I, this this Kraken is just not feeling it. Like this, kind of a kind of a low effort here. 
Maybe maybe they're just saving saving energy for the rematch. I mean, maybe he just really likes being microwaved. He's like, ooh, it's kind of it's kind of warm. I like this. All right. Well, finishing this out. Um, now Shadow Walker has a floater, and Grendy is going into waterfall, and did not check the other side. I don't think Shadow's checked the Black Magic Shop yet, but hopefully he's gonna do that. Doesn't look like it. He may not find fast. Uh oh, not so fast, Shadow. But um. So, question in chat: What does the Element Week thing mean? Um. Each week there is a different element, uh, and the element corresponds to the dungeon where an incentive uh, item is located. So in this case, this is Earth Week, so the chest with the vampire is incentivized. Um, there's also a Chaos Week where um, there are just three loose and none of the Fiend dungeons are incentivized. But yeah, so for this week... Uh, you may have, we may see some matches where you have to double dip Earth, and that always feels as good as it sounds. We got Shadow heading over to our deals, and he's like, he should probably buy a lottery ticket, as I think he's not chosen a wrong pillar yet. No, nope, but he chose the wrong group to run into. But they have nice socks. I, I get it. I made I made the joke. <laughs> Just, despite their checkered past. <laughs> Good follow-up joke. Oh, this is this is gross. This yeah, is this forever. is time sink the fight. Yeah, at least the benefit of all of the levels is that the, the fighter is somewhat resistant to this, but... The... And Grady gets his rod? Now the question is, does Grundy decide to finish cracking out in the area? Because if not, that is uh, a huge, huge boon for Shadow Walker. Another question in chat, doesn't he have two ribbons? He does, but Trance goes through ribbons. It's not elemental, which means we all hate it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much the worst. Hey, look, Medusas. And some marker shirt. In case you're wondering, they're not going away. So Discord is doing Discord things. If I disappear, that's probably what happened, but I'm just not going to touch anything for now. Best to pretend that even if it does Discord things, to just keep talking. You might actually still be here. Yeah, it's just... It, it's... At this point, it's like, I feel like I'm living in a house that was built with no nails. It's just like, alright, I'm just not going to move. House that was built with no nails sounds like a parody of like uh, there is a house down in New Orleans. You know the animal song. Yeah, I love that song. It was oh the house of the rising sun. Wow, yeah. man. You know when you're on comms, like you're real stupid. That's just it's a fact of life. 
I mean, you knew the band. That's that's better than most people. Ooh, ice armor. That's some nice armor. I see what you're doing. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this is super good because now you can move the the Cheerio down to down to the the Black Mage. No, no, horse with no name. That's a different song. Human. House with no name. Horse with no name. Oh, okay. Our house in the middle of the street. No, no, no. Horse with no name. Oh my bad. Yes, horse with horse with no name is by America. You are correct. Welcome to uh, uh, the music portion of the the music quiz portion of tonight's broadcast. Venture Highway is pretty good too. The actual Venture Highway is terrible. I got, I got stuck on it for like an hour. Where is that? I'm just imagining any any highway in, in Ventura County. Okay, I don't know where Ventura County is. No, uh, north of LA. The the road to lovely Oxnard. I, I feel like that was sarcasm. I don't know for certain. A little bit. Oof, that's some poison. Didn't they also have uh, thunder? Yeah, they had they had some rude stuff. I mean, that that fighter usually has like 500 HP, so not not so much. No. But uh, if let's see if, if Grundy is just not doing like a, a quick shopping trip, this this will definitely help out a lot. Shadow Walker, meanwhile, <laughs> 106 in, we have an airship, and it's like, and it's not. Not like either player played bad. It's just the seed was the seed was being a seed. I mean, last week Shadow didn't even get an airship, so he's probably be, he's probably pretty pumped. <laughs> yeah, that is true. This is this is a distinct improvement. He's like, whoa! You can fly in this game, man. Yeah, I was gonna ask, like, why didn't Shadow promote to to, to get the Vorpal or to equip the Vorpal, and then we go. Oh, yeah. He still should probably promote. And Grandy is going back in, so he's going to find his floater. some butter. Gonna have some lobster dinner tonight. Uh, lobster bisque. <laughs> Equip the Zeus Gauntlet, yeah! Yeah, that, that, that always feels good, right? This, this has to be like level 8 warp, right? Unless Level it's eight and Lafane warp. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're surprised. I like uh, camping in our airship. Totally makes sense. You just like pull out a cabin. It, it, it's fine, right? There's no way that uh that airship falls out of the sky. Well, I mean that's an Airbnb. <laughs> but um. <laughs> yeah. The the other funny one is the the cabin in a canoe. Yes, yeah, saving on the river. Just a houseboat. Hey, a, a pro ring. 
use a house on the river. It's like one of those old time riverboat casinos. We have bottle yet, do we? Not that I know of, but I well, could be surprised. Oh, Astos had the bottle. Look at us. Thanks, Danny. Yeah. <laughs> There's warp. There's the little warp. You called it. Not quite in the fame, though. So what are we getting? Drum roll. Come on, Thor hammer. Power doll would be pretty good too. Nah, I was going for the Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's on fire. Uh, you need to tell me what uh what numbers I should get on my Powerball ticket. Because I'm not gonna play that, but you know. If I had that kind of power, I wouldn't be here. I mean, even if you're rich, you gotta have hobbies. No, no, but I mean, like, I would just be on an island hiding out right now. And your island can't have internet? Not satellite internet, but gosh, that's expensive. And slow. Dude, you have infinite money. You can afford it. I didn't get rich by spending foolishly, says man who bought lottery ticket. Grandy's about to get his floater. Gonna be real excited. Or at least somewhat excited. Moderately excited. There's the Thor hammer. All right. <laughs> Yeehaw. All right. So Grendy is going to finish clearing this out, but Grendy is uh, you know, routing this pretty uh, pretty solidly, I would say. Looks like Shadow's going to check mermaids, so he's going to get an X-Cal. And going to be real excited about it. Yeah, this is going to be serious nervous time, though. Like, Shadow's going to wonder, oh no, was, was, was what I needed buried in, in the bottom of Marsh? The answer is probably not. Not unless it's key lock. Oh, I lied. He's not gonna go check mermaids for that other loose. Oh, I just gonna be fast. I mean, fast is good. Yeah, pretty quick trip. Yeah, we have we have ice cave on the table, and we have bottom of earth. Yeah, level one warp is actually going to accomplish, or level eight warp is actually going to accomplish something in this seed. Yeah, he's only got one charge, so he can't like warp all the way out, but it's still going to make it a little faster. Yeah, and I think you know you've you found we've seen power gauntlet Thor hammer in the Cheerio, so we know for sure that both loose are required. Wall mages. What? I mean, don't they do that in vanilla or something similar? I, I think it's the the fighters that have all the defensive spells. The mages okay. just rub and then then like fire three or something. You're or right. Lit, lit three, right? And then they fire through you in the, in the PSP version, just right off the start. Yeah, I've never played the PSP version. <laughs> it's it's fun. I like having nuke stabs. I think I've watched a run of it or two. It looks fun. But it's on the PSP, so... Yeah, it, it's not too hard to emulate. It's just it's just a fun, goofy run, for sure. Right, 
crystal. By Earth 4, did you mean Sky 4? Because we all know that the maze is where Fizzle hit everything. The key is key lock. Chaos finally won. Uh, question in chat. Do they have all the loose items? No, we're still missing one. The floater was the other loose item. Oh boy, that stop went through a ribbon. Fun times. Well, you know, you're gonna get your 3 and 256 out of the way, it might as well be stop. <laughs> against ghouls. Frosties. Who wants to go to Wendy's? I was just there this afternoon. Did you get a Frosty? Yeah. Did it have high evasion? Uh, I don't know. I had trouble picking it up. This is why I like doing comms with you. You just, like, take all these jokes and just knock them out of the park, man. <laughs> Dragon armor. He's gonna be real excited to see that. Yeah, all right. So that is a, a pretty good end game stack there. You have the ribbon, so it's um, you know power gauntlet, pretty good to equip there. Yeah, it's just it, the, the gear on both characters is just absolute premium right now. Yeah, he's. I don't think he wants for anything except maybe a massa. Yeah. Or That's a portal. Oh. Oh, wait. Little, oh. Yeah, I mean, Shadow can get this done with Defense Sword, certainly. Unless, um, there is just a, a real nasty sequence of spells. Because, um, life... Life is available on the night, which I think gets him through most of the, the fights. It's just a matter of if one of them has a ton of HP. And it just can kind of attrition down the night. And that's gonna be hard. Or by attrition you mean nuke and nuclear. Cause that'll take down a 600 HP night pretty quick. Oh, but I'm just thinking like a bunch of like, and not even junk, but like thunders in the pool, infernos in the pool. And that stuff can, can do a ton of chip damage if it just loops through constantly. Ding. So I I just realized they didn't have the chime, so our Sky 4 call is, is extra silly for both <laughs> loose. We're good at this game, man. Well I mean I mean the dream died when we uh, when we found the rod in the uh, in the waterfall. That's true. So yeah. Not sea week. Everything in sea area. We did it. There's the herb. Wait, he's not like he... the herb out. What? <laughs> no, we don't we don't have key yet, but that herb is gonna lead to, to uh key. It's just oh, oh. <laughs> And now he's probably not checking another chest. Oh god, it's drugs, I can't be seen with these. <laughs> Oh wait, that's right, it's legal here now. We're yeah. good. Okay, thank you. It's, it's official Gaia is in Colorado. Yeah, Shadow is in go mode. Well, okay, he's gotta turn that herb in to officially be in go mode, but he is more or less in go mode. Is turning in the herb is walking to a castle. That is, um. Okay. 
I was going to say something that it sounds bad, so I'm just going to say that Blue D has a lot of hit points. All right, I think we all got what you were throwing down there. And Grandy's airborne. Then, uh, I don't think he's. No, he doesn't have the crown yet. Well, double red D is pretty nice to pick up. Yeah, there's been a lot of really good grind tiles if we run into a bad Topher. Nightmare can... Evil Men is super solid, too. Yes, it is. I don't know what his levels are. So 27, um, 29 looks pretty solid. Um, because that's the, the hit break point for for defense getting the fifth hit. I'm glad you know that. Yeah, it it, it shares the, the same hit break points with uh with Xcal. Yeah, I like I, I I haven't played the game since August really, so I've forgotten all the hit break points. So I'm glad you know it. Oh boy, then you'll love the, the cursed and blessed weapons. Yeah, I've been reading. People have been talking about Blurst. I have no idea oh what that no, is. Oh no, there's no bottle. Grandy. Yeah, he needs to go to... Um, As well, he's got to get the crown from our deals, and then he can go to Astos to get the bottle. Yeah, got to cash in that king hat. But he hasn't been to our deals yet. Uh, it looks like Shadow Walker is just doing uh, some greed checks, and that is it. That's a really nice greed check. And I feel really bad for Grendy right now. I, we've all been in this position where you forget which dungeon you haven't done. Well, this is Amazed. a good thing to do while you think about it. Yeah. So, maybe we'll find a war mech. Maybe we won't. Maybe we'll fight for a ride dress. Yeah, trying to freeze the fire hydrants, not going so well. Which is surprising, you would think that would work. While I appreciate your your cheer, I don't think nine sorcerers can do it. Yeah, everybody thinks about um, ice cave when they think about sorcerers, but they're everywhere in vanilla. They're awful. They sure are. <laughs> hey, guess what? We're gonna give you seven of them on the bottom floor. Shadow is just raking in the experience here. Yeah, he's also getting like a million encounters here. Because, you know, Bridge of Destiny is all about the, those encounters. A little bit. And here's Teal. Uses the defense sword. See this? This is what I'm going to use to kill you. Showing it to him again. Yeah. So no no cheeky bane strats at all, just going straight for this. Shadow does not have Sun Sword, nor does he have Excal. He yeah, has this is the, the defense. Yeah, the defense sword. So and there is the fifth hit for the defense sword. Yeah, we have no idea where, where Masmian is. Could be Keylock. You don't know. And Excal is in Mermaids. It's uh, Shadow skipped over entirely. 
Yeah, Grandy has both those swords because he wants the mermaids. And we're gonna turn on our herb, herb get our key. He's going for it. Quick four. Oh. I was... There, there is never value in that banana stand. Oh, hang on, hang on. We gotta pick up life. This is important. This is important. Have Grundy committing to uh, what looks like an earth clear. Which he's got the rod, so that makes sense. Yeah, he's, he's set up well for it. It's just this is gonna soak up some time. And Shadow's gonna go through each and every building in Corneria. It's, it's the Light Warrior Farewell Tour. I mean, he already did a lap, so... Oh, There's the mask. Boy, there it is. Wow. Just just did not want to show off the power of a defense sword, huh? Alright, I see how it is. Yeah, I mean, defense and power gauntlet, I don't really think he needs that. Andy's gonna go do a grind. All right. He's gonna go kill Carrie. Oh, that's right. He hasn't done this. Man. Hey, cheese. No snow cheese. Man, what a good pun. Why didn't I think of that? It might have been a bit too cheesy for you. But it was good enough for me. Now, good is not in here. Or if he is, I haven't seen him. <laughs> if you are here, Gouda, hi. I, I apologize. We sure are killing a lot of monsters. Alright, have the cheese puns been too much? Uh, we're getting criticism in chat. We should leave him probe alone for now. Yeah, I thought I I really want them to have already a good time. Yeah, this is a Swiss attorney. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, now Shadow Walker is just gonna breeze through Earth. have the wooden staff. Now they're in go mode. Yeah, we're, we're good now. Ah oh, man, Falconic is one-upping us with his cheese buns.
Maybe we should switch to condiments so he can't catch up. Wow. <laughs> Any, I don't have any condiments jokes. I Ma mayonnaise. Can you give me another? I would relish the opportunity. <laughs> we had we had Shadow Walker do a quick not here talking to where the vampire would be. is delicious. Although I've had bad poutine and that was that was less fun. Yeah, that, that that certainly is. Like if the gravy is not on point, just don't. Yeah, I ingredient quality is very important. Hey, look, return of the Gersharks. <laughs> Not quite as good as Return of the Mac. Or the Return of the Mac Room. Or the Jedi, I suppose. That is true. <laughs> we have an odd juice fun in chat. <laughs> Um, yes, that was at one point a challenge seat, and we have Warmack Unleashed, we have Required Warmack, you can, uh, thank Meridian, I think, for most of those? My, my personal favorite experience with the Warmack Shuffles was, uh, when Patrolling Warmack was on, and, uh, my friend Angry Larry was, was playing through a seed and hadn't yet gone to, um, waterfall, so we thought that was the actual robot and talked to him, and then just died. <laughs> oh no! Is, is, did he get angry? It, he did. It's not just a clever game then. <laughs> I think that may have been the last scene that he played. But yeah, um, there are all kinds of fun things to do with Warmack, and, and they're all terrifying. And uh, speaking of terrifying, it's like every two two man dive in the in the Temple of Fiends. So here we go. Yeah, he's level thirty. He should be okay. I just get thirty five to be safe. Here's some gas dragons. Oh, oh wow, those are some very dodgy gas dragons. I was just trying to think of like what could be in either of those incentive or uh, validation chests that could help Shadow Walker, and it's just nothing. Um, clearly, it's two cabins. But that would actually be the worst thing because then it would mess up his heal potions. <laughs> like, it's interesting because you don't see very often any situations where open not opening chests is advantageous. Just, just don't do it. It can only hurt you. But you're right, he literally has every piece of equipment he could ever want. Except for Vorpal, since he sold it. Well, I mean, you, you said equipment that you want, so... I think Shadow actually likes Vorpal. I think Shadow likes winning more. Alright, so Grendy is just... is Grendy skipping that, that top set of chests? I mean, it, this, this works out for, for him, but...
That's deep, high spirits. Winning is for losers. Huh. And what, who is losing for? Um, people that use drugs, I think. Oh, okay. Unless you're in Colorado. Yeah, that is true. Or in Alpha. Hey, we found the third ribbon! Hooray! One of those uh, dead pirates can flip it. Oh yeah, that's right. Can we still revive nuns? Did they fix that? I don't think so. Oh. That, that was a fun time. Yeah, I, I think that was very short-lived, but I agree it was a fun time. Speaking of fun time, you're scary. That is a fair amount of damage going into somebody that has all the MGA equipment. Yeah, I, I feel like that Black Mage would die if he hit Yeah. But, um, no, it's, it, it's pretty good. Well, we are gonna burn quite a few, uh, heal pots. Yeah. I, the, uh, fortunately, the, the attrition aspect of Temple of Fiends is, is not as brutal as it used to be because. If these waters were unrunnable, that would not be a good day. I think Shadow just grabbed life and, and, and went for it. And yeah, we were busy making cheese fun puns. I, you're gonna have to forgive me. I have no idea if he picked up heal three. Alright, and uh, on Grundy's side we have the the OG Lich, and they're about to get blown up. Okay. No, I, I I think Lich Lich can win this one. I I'm I would like to see how much damage this next hit does. Yeah, that's pretty good. Man, I lost that bet again. One of these days, Lich is gonna get his revenge. <laughs> one of these days. I like how, I like how even with alternate final boss, when you get the Lich Phantoms, Lich isn't the one that kills you. <laughs> Four one hundred percent crit Phantoms. It's like I'm getting hit eight times. All right, so defense strats. Um, and that's nuclear a doesn't care. It just sometimes set up though. What's next? Oh, oh boy. Alright. <laughs> Second nuclear! Alright. This is where Me. things get real scary. Stop. Ineffective. How much HP does this guy have? Because going through the skill list would be awful, but... Less than that, which is 900-ish. Oh, there's the L3. Grandy's gonna go get his Thor hammer, and he's sad. Whoa. Okay, they have cremate, we're good. Oh no, no, they also like punching. Okay. How many potions do we have left? That is not 25. Enough. Uh, no, it's not. Uh, there's barely enough to get the thing. Ooh, put the put the best. This is this is spicy. Let's see if this works. Crunch. All right, yeah. So, came out um, doing that to a mage probably feels good, but ooh, okay, no tempers. Probably doesn't need him. Oh, that's a crits. Yeah, crits. Crits are crits are not so good. But um, it looks like six stacks of evasions, kind of a, a whole day, and hope no crits. Nope, there, here comes the spells now. Okay, we're ready. 
But, <laughs> Holy cow! Okay, no absorb. <laughs> but you know, fast and three uh three power gauntlets says good night. Yeah, that's 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 a lot. I think now is the time to use the heal freeze. Oh, I'm gonna, gonna save. Save one of them. Oh, we are down to uh, very, very little heal potions. And this is unrunnable, of course. Well, looks like he's gonna get away fairly unscathed. Yeah, meanwhile, Grendy does not have work, so gotta do this the long way. Oh no! Hello. Uh, they're, they're pretty big too, but of course they're also very inaccurate, so... Oh, got yes. away with not being hurt. No, Just right, a free have, level. Have another level. Hey, that's the fifth hit on the Warple. Oh, wait. See what you did there. And we're gonna pull Chaos at 140. How come we don't ever get a gold max? Is that copyright infringement? No, it's just a really bad game. <laughs> How dare you? Have you played it? It's terrible. <laughs> yes, yes I have, but I want other people to play it. I can't be the only one that's miserable. <laughs> well, well, clearly I have played it, and I have been miserable, so... So we have, we have Temper, we have Power Gauntlet, Chaos is just, just let them set up and there's a nuclear. Alright. That is a real there's high a roll nuclear too. And that is a real high roll hit. So how much HP does Chaos have? Not enough. Uh, not that much. GG yeah. Shadow. Yeah, that was uh, that was very, very disappointing absorb on both T2 and, and Chaos. But only disappointing for the fiends. Very good for the runners. GG. And Grendy has decided he's not going to finish it. Uh, Shadows finished in first place with a SRL time 141.38. Yeah, off to a... Uh, off to a, a roaring start here for, for week two. And... Uh, We'll uh, we'll see who we can get to, to stop by for for some interviews. Yeah, let's see if we can get them to make some cheese puns as well. That'd really, cap off the night here. And we're joined by a shadow walker. Welcome, Shadow. Good job. Hello. Thanks. GG. So that seemed to be a pretty friendly, except for late warp as far as as far as two-man strats go. It could have been much worse. I felt like I got pretty solid RNG on a lot of the early game insta-kills. Um, definitely saw a couple of squints and glances that missed in the early game before I had those ribbons. And uh, those could have cost me a lot more time. Yeah, the uh, the early ribbon definitely helped out a lot, and finding the second one not too too far down the road um, was there were definitely some nasty abilities kicking around. Just he had good defense for it. Yeah. So, how many more treasure chests would you have opened looking for Mazmian? Just the rest of uh, Canaria locked. Those were literally going to be the last six chests that I opened. Okay, yeah, I was curious if you might check the, the bottom of, of Earth or not, but... No. Yeah. I was just looking at those because they were close. Um, being in the area, I felt fine looking for them. But I didn't want to go too far out of my way. Uh, I only really had two hits. It was either uh, Maza or Excal since I had sold the Katana to get the Adamant money. So I wasn't going to open that many chests. Even yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know, that one that I sold that has good crit. 
Yeah. yeah. I, that was my next question. How sad were you when you had to sell that portal? I... It was one of those things in the back of my mind. It was like, okay, uh, I will sell the Opal Shield and I will have enough money to buy Adamant. And I looked at it and I was just short. And I was like, well, either this short sword sells for an awful lot or that Maz is on the chopping block. And I'm a little bit sad, but not the end of the world. You, you had a Warpal. You're, just, you're it, saying every man. sword but Warpal. <laughs> <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> uh, can, can, can you blame I just, you know, it got brain holed. As as the Vorpal is wont to do. I want you to call it a silver sword next time you talk about it. I mean, it is a sharpened silver sword, but. <laughs> yeah, so it looks like we've got Grundy in chat as well. GG to Grundy for, uh, you know, putting up a pretty good fight, I would say, in this uh, in this sort of mirror match. Just, uh, you know, routed the seed pretty well, just, uh, just a little behind him in, in certain areas, and finding the floater later. Uh, certainly proved to be costly. Yeah, that floater was an extremely convenient find, and so convenient, in fact, that I forgot to check mermaids afterwards. <laughs> I was like, hey, I've got a floater. I'm on my way. Yeah, there was some good stuff in mermaids. I think it was uh, Excal and Sunstorm, but uh, huh? I mean, it, it turned out to work out in the end. Yep. And I think, uh, honestly, it was doable with uh, Defense Sword, although the high roll nuclear at the end made things pretty dicey. Yeah, the, that Topher certainly had a, a couple of nuclear surprises for me. I was not thrilled to see that every time it came up. But yeah, I know Kraken it... had one or two, Chaos had one. So how scared were you when you saw the Iron Galls the step before the stairs? Uh, I had eight potions. I, I was terrified. Actually, at that point, I had already used all of my potions. Um, oh, I thought you still had, like, eight. My bad. No, I, I had exactly one after I healed up after Tia, and I used that immediately after the vamp was vamp. And I saw the iron golems, and I was like, oh, this is going to be terrible. And then they just had no absorb, and it was fine. Well, I think they may have had absorb. You critted both of them. I, I mean, yeah. But they were crits for like 500, which that's pretty high. So, I don't know. Anyway, uh, GG, have any final thoughts? Uh, no, I was, I was actually really impressed uh, watching Granny in the first week. And so when I saw that I was paired up with him, um, I wanted to run two man strats with him. So that way he could see how uh, somebody approaches it from a high level. Uh, I know he's hung out in Artea stream and certainly watched him do two man strats, but I wanted to see him. I, I wanted to have him see a seed that was side by side. Um, so definitely, Grendy, uh, if you're down for it, watch that one back and see how we approach the seed differently. Yeah, I think it, Grendy did a, a, a really good job. There's a lot of stuff early that could have. Uh, could have really put Grendy in a hole that uh, that he avoided, and uh, I mean, for for a newer player to this to, to run two man as as well as he did is, is pretty impressive. So I hope. Oh yeah. Uh, I hope to see some further success. People facing Grendy in two months, watch out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> you got lucky that this wasn't the summer tournament. But yeah, I think that's gonna do it for uh, for our opening week two race. Thanks for uh, thanks for putting this together so quickly, uh, and uh, yeah, thanks to Fizzle and Danny for for doing the uh, the back end work. Yeah, thanks Fizzle, thanks Danny, thank Edge for for joining me real quick, and uh, we'll see you next week, shall we?